So hello to everyone. I'm Vahagan Khachatyan from, from Armenia, uh, a medical student from Yerevan. So I have five minutes for me, which is uh, too much. So uh, first of all, I, I want to say that uh, I love the beautiful nature. So uh, I feel like I'm, I'm in Laplandia. Thank you for your hospitality as well. So regarding my scientific project, this project uh, is still ongoing. So also I'd like to talk a little bit about histochemical method which was developed in my lab. So the method we use uh, during experiments to find out the morphological and histo histological chance after experiments. Um, so uh, as, uh, as we know, the stress can be very di different, including environment, negative emotions, hypodynamia, in this case, immobilization stress, uh, food, drinks, uh, much more alcohol continuing. So uh, in this case, considering my lab's opportunities, we set two goals. So the first one is histochemical and morphological analysis of red brain neurons of amygdala after immobilization stress. The second one is an electrophysiological study of effect of taurine on the parameters of background impulse activity of red uh, brain neurons of amygdala after immobilization stress. Mm -hmm. For the goals, we, uh, we use two simple lab methods. One of them is well known uh, to neuroscientists, uh, the first one. The second one is his, uh, uh, the sec uh, sorry. Uh, the second one is developed in my lab with my co-workers. So histochemical approach to detecting the activity of calcium to plus uh, dependent acid phosphatase. So also I'd like to remind the acute immobilization stress uh, was uh, caused by fixing the anim animal on its back uh, in the specially developed box uh, for the experiments for two hours. Mm -hmm. For histochemical uh, studies, we, uh, we decided to do experiments in four groups. The first one as a, a control group, NORMA. The second one is five days after the stress. The third one is three days of taurine injection after five days stress. The fourth one is uh, seven days of taurine injection after five days stress. So uh, here we can uh, see the advantages of histochemical method. Uh, there are many. Uh, I think the important one is that it's simple, cheap, and available. So here we can find complete information about method, like a protocol. So uh, uh, those are the histochemical results of experiment where we can see the neuroprotective effects of taurine. So in uh, these and these lines, those are uh, the results after extracellular electrophysio electrophysio um, electrophysiology. Mm -hmm. And finally, the conclusion, as a conclusion, we can say that taurine has neuroprote neuroprotective effect on the neurons of amygdala with the systematic introduction of taurine immediately after stress. As a suggestion, we can say that uh, psychoemotional stress can be prevented by taurine. So I should use a taurine before my speech. <laughs> So, uh, any remarks or comments? No? Thank you very much for your, <laughs> for your attention and cooperation.